Hey there, tumbleweeds! I am sorry that I didn't post a video last weekend, but there has been a lot going on <clears throat> since I left uh, New Mexico. I went back to Arizona and went to visit Bob at the alpaca farm for a couple of nights. And then I had reservations at an, uh, Thousand Trails RV Park, or it's an Encore RV Park, which is part of Thousand Trails. So I, I got this um, free Thousand Trails membership when I bought my RV last year. So um, I stay at those occasionally because they are free for me. So uh, I stayed there um, for... 13 nights, which is the maximum you can stay. And uh, it was kind of nice <laughs> to be hooked up to electricity and water and sewer for a little while. And uh, I was able to run my air conditioner pretty much all day long. Surprise, Daisy is getting washed for the first time since December. <laughs> Uh, last year these guys are so fast i swear they just started and they're almost done already and they're washing and they're gonna wax it too and look no more bugs i'm so excited hey chiclet are you enjoying the air conditioning it's nice and cool isn't it Hard. so i can run the air conditioner all day long and not have to run my generator because I am sick. <laughs> and Piglet, she's not feeling too good either. Yeah, Once my time was up there, I tried to go back to see Bob at the alpaca farm, and it was just too hot. <laughs> I ran, I had 87% of LP or propane left in my tanks when I arrived at Bob's. And I was there for two nights, and I ran it completely out. That was just for running the air conditioner, which ran constantly all day. And I shut it off probably about at 7 or 8 p.m. at night, and it was still kind of hot in there. So. so I decided to look for cooler weather. I, w I did have reservations at... Um, a national forest campground in on the Mogollon Rim. I can't remember the name of the campground. But when I checked the wet, the temps a couple of days before I was supposed to go there, um, it was still pretty hot there. So I got out my weather app, which I always do, and started looking at places that weren't too too far away, and discovered that. Back in New Mexico, where I was a couple of weeks ago, in the Cimarron Canyon, uh, the temps were going to be in the 70s for at least 10 days. And it was in the mid-90s everywhere else. So, I already had reservations at a campground in Cimarron Canyon, uh, which I was not sure if I was going to keep or not, but I decided to cancel the National Forest Campground on the Mogollon Rim and go ahead and keep my reservations in Cimarron Canyon. And I am so happy that I did that because it is so nice and cool here. Oh my gosh, I just can't believe how nice it is. So here's a little bit of the video to show you my travels getting here um it was a bit stormy when i arrived okay we'll catch you later it's getting stormy in nicholas i just pulled down this road so i can put my camera up. <laughs> Thank you. 